Alright, so we're in Morocco right now, and I kind of don't know where exactly we are, but apparently it's a giant uh, set that has been used in like Gladiator, I think like The Mummy, Game of Thrones. So you just kind of see um, a lot of these beautiful sets right here, and maybe it's not all fake because it looks, uh, it's pretty amazing, and, and it definitely feels like an Egyptian desert. I mean, we actually are in the desert, but yeah, it's pretty cool. <laughs> My camel. I want to know his or her name. Say hello. Gorgeous. Okay, so we have finally arrived at this uh, Berber camp. I'm not exactly sure what makes it uh, Berber, but we are going to have dinner right now. It's probably traditional like tagine. Um, and right now, I, have, I think it's like my soup that I really, really like. But we had an excellent camel ride. Uh, we had light for about maybe 45 minutes, and then it was darkness. But it's a really, really cool experience, and then we're going to get up early in the morning. sun is about to come up. I slept very well. The sunrise. As we head back into the town that we see up there. This is one of the tanneries in Fess where they take off the skins of the animals and then dry them and turn them into things. And it was a little difficult getting here. A lot of people trying to get me to buy stuff or trick me. So this is how I wanted to end the trip, kind of the typical Indiana Jones place that I always had in my mind of what Morocco is. So I have my 
Moroccan salad. Blue gate right by me. And I'm glad to call it a trip over. But at the same time, I'm glad I went. I definitely am.